Good reviewers and welcome to your best learning hub for the sciences, Jalo Science Academy. In this video, I'll be responding to a question from one of our viewers asking me to demonstrate how they can separate carbonates from bicarbonates. Now, to separate carbonates from bicarbonates, we are going to use the reagent. So we can use calcium chloride. Now with calcium chloride, if we use it on carbonate, we will precipitate calcium carbonate directly. But if we react bicarbonate and calcium chloride, we, we won't be able to precipitate calcium carbonate except we have to heat the product. These are the equations. When these two react, you are going to get calcium carbonate that will be formed and then you get two chloride ions. This is already a solid. This is insoluble, which is a white precipitate that is formed. And for bicarbonates, When a bicarbonate reacts with calcium chloride, you are going to get the calcium hydrogen carbonate and two chloride ions that are formed. And this is an aqueous substance. So meaning it is soluble, it dissolves. But if you heat this, this calcium bicarbonate now, if this one is heated, it is going to dissociate into calcium carbonate and water. So this gives you the solid substance. So this now is insoluble. So meaning carbonate precipitate calcium carbonate with calcium chloride directly, whereas bicarbonate don't precipitate calcium carbonate directly. They first of all produce calcium bicarbonate, and then when this is heated, you then have calcium carbonate that is formed.